in water softening, there is settings that we have to set um, to make it right for your water. One of the first things that a, a guy like myself will come in and do is test your water for hardness. To do that, we go through a test strip system that I'll describe to you in a little bit. The first thing we come in and do is do that, and then we come to the water softener itself and look at, at the settings. Some softeners, there's several different kinds of softener controls, if you will. Um, some are mechanical, some are digital, um, some work off of flow, and some work off of time. This particular model we're looking at works off of time. To set this one, what you need to do is, there's obviously a clock here. You depress the button to set the clock and the time of the day, and you set it for the time of the day, and then inside of here, there is what, this is the regeneration uh, time frame and there's a couple little tabs in here that you have to pull and set for time frames inside of the unit itself. Each one of them has a different setting. One of them will be 24 hours, one of them will be a week, and one of them will be two weeks. And then one of them will be, I believe it's a month in this one. Um, and then we'll kind of, what you do is you determine that by the flow of how much water you use and you base that off of people that you have in your house. Like if there's two people, it's based off of, I believe, like 1,100 gallons. Um, so you'll do that as a time frame to when you use 1,100 gallons, which will probably be about once a week on that level um, with two people in the house. Um, and that's basically how you set up for hardness in the, in the system itself. Then the other type of water softeners, the ones with flow, they'll have a setting on them for gallons. How many gallons that you'll be using up. Um, it'll have a dial on it that'll pull out and go to say 1200 gallons, 1100 gallons like we've discussed with the two people in the house at that point in time. Uh, the other ones are the digital simple ones also work off of flow and you'll basically just punch, there's a one button system, you'll punch it up and there you have where your flow is at, at 1100, 1200. It's also advisable to make sure always to have somebody that knows what they're doing test the water if you're not familiar with it. Don't be afraid to ask questions either because there's a lot of helpful people out there that can help you out.